Alright, good morning guys. Um the only thing that I did this morning was just washing my face, brushing my teeth, and now it's time obviously for coffee, right? After that, I'll show you or in between I show you how I do like my shake that I take with me. It's like a protein shake but with a bunch of stuff in it, so I'll show you that. By the way, I love double shot coffee, right? Oh, we are running out of beans, bro. Mm, where the heck? Let me refill the coffee beans. Good, right. we're good. Let's go. Oh, I'll show you something, guys. I thought um, I bought something pretty good, right? But I didn't, so I'll show you something. This Kit Kat, right? Um, they come with pop, 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 24 grams of sugar, like 70 grams of, I mean, per 100 gram, 70 grams of carbs and 24 grams of sugar. And bro, look at them. No added sugar. The same, bro. They also taste the same. Um, just 74 grams of whole carbs and 0 0.4 grams of sugar. I mean, bro, definitely the same. I don't know what they do to them. But yeah, anyways, um, my shake. This is the one that I take every day with me. And the protein that I use is, it's a local brand. It's called um, Rhein Natur. Um, they're making protein powder, but just protein powder, like no added things, nothing. And the cool thing about that is that they use grass-fed cows milk, right? Um, so it's organic and all of that crap. Anyways, is that thing able to follow me over here? Oh, it is. So, in that shake, I definitely put, what the heck? Oh yeah, here we go. Frozen strawberries, all right. Then, obviously, Mm, oats, right? Banana, obviously, in that, and peanut butter, bro. So overall, I should show you the calories, right? So cool thing about these apps that can track your calories are that you can sc scan the code, right? It's so easy. And I definitely use milk, right? Because yeah, I don't know, some people th say that milk is not best for you, but bro, come on. By the way, I'm just eyeballing, so don't come to me and say, hey bro, you're not using the right measurements. I mean, I'm bulking, right? And definitely I want to have a calorie surplus, right? But I'm not that dude that tracks it 100%, you know what I mean? I, I feel that... I feel it kind of, it's a waste of time, yeah? That's how I feel about that, but probably um, you feel different about that. Anyways, let me taste the first sip, bro. Damn, coffee's different, bro. Anyways, I'll go with eyeballing like 400, milliliters of milk. I mean, I know for a fact that this is the right amount. Um, it's just experience. I mean, I do it like every day. But for you guys, I will give that 
you know what, I will scan that. So, let's see, 400, like 280 calories. Then a banana, I would say this is the middle size banana and this is like a large, all right? So I go with the middle one, all right, banana in it. Then I go with a cup of oats, so. Here we go. One hundred grams. So I think that this is one hundred grams. So three hundred eighty calories. Frozen berries. And to be honest, I don't track frozen berries. Nah, bro, you don't have to track them. I mean, look at that. Oh. So, frozen berries, calories, even though I think that you don't have to track that because they are like almost nothing, 100 grams. But I think I put like 80 grams, um, are 31 calories. I mean, okay, let's go. Why not? Let's track that. Then, peanut butter <laughs> has definitely um, a bunch of calories. Yeah, I definitely go with a lot of peanut butter because I love peanut butter. So, a big spoon. All right, I would say 40 kilograms. Okay, 40 grams, bro. <laughs> big spoon, I mean, so yeah. Good. Let's track that too. Bro, it's so convenient that you can just take a photo of this coast, bro. So, 40, 340 calories. No, 240 calories. So, we are almost to the 1000 calorie mark. All right, obviously, my protein uh, powder. So, I'll go with two scoops. And these two scoops are 50 grams. So we are at 1140 calories. So, pretty good, right? I mean, um, I see it like this. I use this kind of protein powder because I feel like all these other brands, and I might be wrong, but all these are other brands with so much added sugar or added other stuffs. Um, I don't know. At the end, it's really just milk powder. You know what I mean? Like protein powder and when you mix it with other stuff bro you don't really need like chocolate caramel or something like that but yeah it's obviously just my opinion so here we go look at that color bro Easy and it doesn't take that long. I mean, we have more than thousand pretty healthy calories in here and we are good to go, right? You guys probably might know that I'm a big fan of bags. I mean, I have a lot of bags collected like over the years and this is one of my main bags that I use. I think I use that almost daily and it's pretty sturdy, right? It's from Nike. I think it's the trail collection, I think. I don't know. The only downside is, even though I love bags and pockets, 
it has too much. I really don't know <coughs> what to put in that. Here we have, have like my changing wear, right? For my work day, my towels and all of that for the shower and my toiletry bag. And this toiletry bag I use for content creation. I don't know how they call it on the North Face website, but probably if you are inter interested in that, I can link that. Anyways, um, thing is, I have here my wrist wraps, like a gimbal, no, I think a tripod. So another tripod, AirPods, my mouthpiece, and microphones, gimbal, all of that, so, right, yeah. And this is my bag that I use for my work, and there goes like my phones, my keys, and all of that, yeah. <laughs> A big bag guy, right? All right, guys, I think we are done. So I will drink one more coffee, get into the car, and I'll see you there. All right, welcome, guys. So, we are heading to John Reed Fitness Gym and I'll be honest, I don't have that high appetite today, don't know why. I drank just a bit, so yeah, as I said, my appetite is not that high today, but hey, we have to put the calories in, right? And on the other hand, I don't want to go and train hard with like a full stomach. So, yeah. Okay. Oh, and I definitely have thought about to change things up, right? To go like with uh, chest day, back day, leg day and arms day. And on arms day, probably to put like just biceps and triceps and to go with abs in between something like that because having a dedicated arm day is pretty cool i mean it's not it can be beneficial but it's not like you have to do it but um, having an arm day is like i don't know it feels good right um that's for sure the pump is unreal, right? And yeah, but okay. Um, we'll see what the future brings. And by the way, I'm pretty proud to say that we are on day 10. So I know it's not much, right? But the journey continues and I definitely I'm glad that I started, yeah. <laughs> but okay, and you see that it's pretty, pretty bright outside. All that means spring and summer are already coming. And I mean, you love to see that, right? Bro, tired, still tired, even though, well, okay, I didn't had a lot of coffees. I think I did just two, no, f yeah, two coffees will double shot espresso. That means nowhere near my normal intake of coffee. So normally I will do like two double shot coffees and two or three normal coffees. All right, guys, we are almost there. I will grab a coffee and a hydration drink and I'll see you guys in the video. I warmed up properly. That means... <laughs> go all out. 
So I'll show you this variation of rose, cable rose. I love that bro. <laughs> really I saw a YouTube video and that guy probably should link that too he described why pulling it like this might be the best for lat growth Up. Last one felt kind of heavy. Um, I decreased the weight, but five kgs, so I might be able to do eight clean reps. Here we go. bring back working out till we can't move bro I love to do when I'm performing lat pull-downs is the part where you stretch your arms, right? I'll go a bit forward with my chest and then get a pretty significant stretch into my lats. So, pro tip. <laughs> Set number two. I think I will leave the weights as it is, like 70 kilograms, and try to perform a better set um, that's also a key to have a good workout. Like, let's say your set is not perfect, right? You don't hit the reps that you want, or you don't feel the mind muscle, you don't feel the mind muscle connection that good. I mean, there's always another set, right? And with that in mind, you should go like. For the next set, you should go like, you know what? Now I have to improve the things that I did wrong or not so good in the last set. So, let's try to improve on my muscle connection. Let's go. Oh. All right, 
Good set. Let's go. <clears throat> one let's see probably the angle is not that good because I cramp in my lap right now reminder not every set is perfect right let's go Yeah, the angle is pretty good. Compared to that straight one, perfect. Last one, guys. Here we go. Weight will still be 50 kilograms. And I try to perform like eight, nine or 10, I don't know. Something in that range. definitely stay here and I will perform like shrugs and as I said before the workout I will do like four or five sets Good. Full stack again. Like, I will decrease the weight, but ah, maybe next set, bro. Now I will decrease the weight. Oh. 
Oh my god. So performance wise it would be more like whew, sorry it would be more, what the, it would be more safe and also it would be, make more sense to lay down on a bench and to perform that but um, even though I'm bending over um, I really can't move more forward right and a bit of swing is not a big problem as long as you hit like the targeted muscle so yeah all good bro believe me <laughs> when I say that rare delts make or break a physique um, you might think ah, you know what that's just when you're like posing your back or something like that right but no um, the shape of the rare delts give like the whole 3d look like for the delts right so yeah definitely something to be aware of right so just my take on that <laughs> The key is to not let go, yeah? You know what I mean? Like, when you're performing that and you're like in the sixth rep, um, I kind of feel like sometimes I'm just letting it go, hanging, if you know what I mean? But um, I have to contract the muscle, the full range of motion, so. Thing is, I walked around in the gym. I looked for a good spot to train my biceps, but bro, actually, <laughs> I'm pretty good here, bro. Gosh. 
yeah, let's set with the straight bar. And then, I guess then, I will do like concentration curl, well, concentration cable curls, bro. Okay, let's go. See that, bro? What the fuck? Full day of eating, so my shake, I got some snacks, some gummy bears, and I guess the gummy bears were like 260 calories, so pretty okay. And <clears throat> this whole two burgers and fries have 1,700. So overall more than 3K, 3,047. 120 gram of fat, 300 grams of carbs and 180 grams of protein so overall pretty good we did it guys i'm so full right now <laughs> as you can see anyways um thing is it's almost nine that means i have to go shower get ready for bed and sleep bro the only thing that i have to do right now is to put the footage into the mac and because that takes quite a bit of time like Sometimes it depends on the footage, but I would say around 20 minutes. So, yeah. Actually, I was like, you know what? I should perform like one or two or three sets on T-bar row. But <clears throat> to be honest, I don't miss that because actually it was so full and so packed on that area uh, that I did like cable rows and... They were pretty good. I mean, I feel pretty good. My back is still, you know, it's not a pump anymore, but so I don't know if you can relate, but sometimes when I train a muscle group, let's say hours later, I still can feel it like it's a bit pumped. You know what I mean? Like not in a sense like a real pump in the gym, but still it's pretty solid. Arms was pretty good. Um, as I promised, the exercises that I did I will put a link from some youtubers that um, recommended this type of styles I, and I think some of them can explain better why and how to perform that exercise but yeah hopefully you have a great day guys or you had a great day um, I might not be able to upload the video tomorrow but definitely on Thursday so stay tuned for that I wish you as I said a crazy good start in the day or 
I wish you had a good fucking day. Depends where you are, right? Or when you watch this. Anyways, guys, thank you. I have work to do. And see you in the next video, guys. <laughs> We got power